guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new video today's video is going to be a little weekend vlog i asked on my instagram what type of videos you want to see going forward what you actually enjoy watching and nine times out of ten it was um for vlogs and i usually don't vlog on a weekend i usually vlog like monday or friday for my weekly vlogs and then have the weekends off but i thought actually let me just show you a little bit of what i actually get up to on a weekend obviously we are in lockdown so things are a little bit different right now um but we've got a nice weekend planned a nice little christmasy cozy weekend so i thought it would be perfect opportunity to vlog it so it is friday night now i'm holding you right under a light so that is why i look so bright right now and my hair's a little bit crazy because we've just got back from the dog walk it's pitch black outside even though it's only five o'clock i'm gonna light some candles i'm gonna clean the house get it all nice and ready for the weekend i'm gonna cook dinner have a glass of wine and probably have a movie night to be honest that is my plan um so yeah i thought i'd just bring you along with me and yeah let's get into the video <laughs> Keep on telling lies That is how we stay alive mm. So you know that I don't mind About what is wrong and what is right They keep moving in different rhythms Still I know what you feel They keep moving tonight is this chorizo crusted pen and cheese which looks so nice i've been so excited to eat this um all week so i'm gonna follow that it should only take 30 minutes to make i've got all the ingredients <laughs> that's kobe's dinner i've got all the ingredients out ready to go and yeah i'm gonna pop in a little time lapse and i will show you the finished product Excuse my hair by the way. I'm from Flash and Red, so I'm gonna carry on making dinner and I'll show you the finished product. And dinner is served. This is what it's looking like. Jo you don't mess Are you joking? <sighs> Tender stem brock and a nice glass of Savvy B. So we're gonna eat this now and then I'm gonna eat some chocolate and watch some Disney. Now with this in a Christmas little spread, Jordan's just put together a lovely little cheese board. I really fancied some matchmakers. Don't even ask why. I just fancied them. Jordan, every time I film food, do you have to put your hand in? But yeah, delish. While eating all of this rubbish and drinking, I'm also just browsing the Black Friday um, Gymshark sale. I really need some new gym clothes. And I'm going to treat myself to quite a bit. So I will show you all what I get when it does arrive in a future vlog so keep a lookout for that oh guys look at our little reindeer he's not gonna stay here obviously um but he can stay here for tonight how cute is he i don't know where i want to put him i don't think i want him on the floor because corby will pr probably attack him but very cute Um, the Sainsbury's, oh, I look so rough, the Sainsbury's advert from last year, I want to find the greatest gift, that one, um, 
today. I've just been watching Christmas adverts, to be honest. The John Lewis one came out today. And I'm not going to lie. I hate to be Scrooge, but I just didn't really like it. I feel like it didn't tug on my heartstrings. It didn't make me cry. I don't think it's a good advert unless it makes me cry. Um, however, the Disney one made me cry and the McDonald's one made me cry. So go and watch them if you haven't watched them. Christmas advert we're talking about here if you didn't click onto that. Um, but yeah, really like them ones. By the way, the wine I'm drinking is just a Californian... Ca California Sauvignon Blanc. Um, it's just from Aldi. Usually I like a New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc, but this is just an Aldi one. It's actually really nice. Um, like when it's nice and cold with ice, it's nice and fresh. So I've just topped myself up with a glass of that. I'm going to take myself up to bed, do my skincare, get in bed and look at Christmas decorations and order a new tree. How exciting. Um, I'm probably going to leave the vlog here for tonight, but I will speak to you all in the morning. Good morning everybody, happy Saturday. I've just had a shower and done my skincare. Jordan actually said that my skin looks the best it's ever looked, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Thank you. I actually, Alex literally went through like my skincare routine and did it for me because I had so many products but I didn't really know like what order I should be doing things or, um, are you eating grapes? Mm. I didn't know what, what? Want coffees? You can make them. I didn't know what order I should be doing things in or like how often I should be doing things. <laughs> Sorry, Jordan's literally playing with Corby in the corner. Um, so yeah, my skin feels really good after two days. <laughs> I've actually taken it a bit seriously. Um, big public service announcement. Jordan, this is serious. I ran 5K this morning. Stop. Don't do a loud aggressive clap. So yeah, that's the first time I've ever ran. I'm so proud of myself considering I went for my first run on Monday and by the end of the week I've done 5k. That is just, I didn't even think I'd be able to do 2k, never mind 5. So I'm very, very happy. Couch Jordan's to 5k. Sorry? Couch to 5k. Yeah, couch to 5k. <laughs> <laughs> um, so plan of action for today, Jordan is about to make me some breakfast. You can make a bacon sandwich with egg. It's going to make Kobe scrambled eggs. Kobe always has scrambled egg on a weekend because he's spoil rotten. We are then going to go to the garden centre and look at Christmas decorations and have a nice, cosy Christmas family day. Jordan's going at this to wrap it up because he wants to get started on the coffees. So let's make breakfast. I've been dreaming all night, bringing me some inspiration. Never meant to love no one. But baby, I saw you for a second and I'm happy that you came my way Don't wanna waste no time without you ever brightening up my days Never meant to fall so hard Okay, I am ready for the day. Um, I just popped on a little bit of makeup. Again, no foundation because I just don't like how it looks at the minute. Um, quite a few people have asked for an updated makeup routine, like a no foundation one. So if you want me to do that, let me know and I will. Um, I've got on some black skinny jeans from Zara. This turtleneck is Topshop. I got it, no word of a lie, years ago. And it's just a staple that I just couldn't get rid of. Um, this jacket is new from Fashion Nova. Really, really nice. It's looking more like grey on camera, but it's like a really nice beige. Boots are my public desire new chunky ones. 
and Givenchy mini bag. We are off to the garden centre and I can't wait to look at Christmas decks. <laughs> Keep on telling lies That is how we stay alive mm. So you know that I don't mind About what is wrong and what is Okay guys, we are out of the garden centre I did not vlog a lot because to be quite honest it was a little bit stressful I don't know why we decided to go to the garden centre on a Saturday morning It was so busy wasn't it? We got a queue like I think it took about 15 minutes to get in so it wasn't too bad. Um, Colby did a poo in the middle of the garden centre. Yeah, um, so Jordan and I picked that up and carry it around with him. I was carrying the basket. I was also carrying a mini Christmas tree. Colby was on the lead, running wild. It was very stressful so I didn't vlog a lot. Trying to eat all the little Christmas decorations. Um, yeah, it was just a little bit stressful. However, also at the same time very successful. I got loads of really nice baubles, I got loads of really nice decorations. I don't think I'll really need that much more to be honest. Maybe like I want to get a nice, um, what do we need? A tree. Oh yeah we obviously need a tree. A base. A base. And what was the thing for the front? What's it called? It's gone from my head. A wreath. We need a wreath and we need... A wreath. We need two little penguins when you walk in. Jordan wants like little Santa signs that say like Santa this way and I'm like... How does Santa going to know when to stop? That's just a bit tacky. It might be tacky but ask the fans. I'm going for a rustic vibe, right? right. Well, anyway, let, why, don't so, we just let the, why don't we let the viewers decide? Santa stop here sign or not? Okay, Santa stop here sign or not for little Corby so that he brings you presents. Corby's exhausted from the whole experience. But yeah, we've got loads of really nice baubles. I'll give you a little haul when I get back and I need to order our new Christmas tree because I just want to put it all up and I'm really excited about it. Oh look at that little cover poo. Oh, you look like a short haired Kogi. Um, so yeah, all in all, it's been a success. It's so miserable, like just windy and rainy and horrible. So I want to get home and put my cozy new lounge wear set on and do some Christmas shopping. Alrighty, we are home from the garden centre and I'm going to show you what we picked up before I start putting stuff away. First things first, we got this cinnamon and fruit bag. It's basically just like mixed like acorns and stuff. It smells Christmassy. My plan is to put a nice candle in the middle, put it round in a bowl. I did this last year, um, but we went on new decorations plus they smell a lot nicer. And it's just a nice little centerpiece for like a table or something. And I loved it last year, especially with the candle inside. So I thought do the same again then we got this little tree oh look how cute she is she's gonna go in the living room i think either on a side on a windowsill just somewhere on a windowsill probably in the living room i think so we've got her then bauble wise actually let me just show you this really random thing that we got we've got a little mini frying pan for the eggs that Jordan makes to go in the bacon sandwiches. <laughs> Very random, but we got that. Um, baubles. We got these little mini like cream ones. I've said I'm going for like a nude rustic tree, so got them. We got these ones, which are like gold, silver, crackly type of texture. Again, just like the main ones. And then in terms of like nice decorative ones we got three of these so like little acorns with snow on them three of them we got three of these so like more sparkly um gold bigger ones and we got three of these little twiggy snowflake things. So yeah, all in all, I think it was a success. I don't know if we need more baubles. I'm gonna have to wait and see what I think um, when the tree's up. But I think that was a pretty good start. If you ask me, I'm gonna put up the little tree and stuff now. 
Um, and then obviously need to order my Christmas tree. But as soon as that comes, it's going up. What are we waiting for? We've got nothing else to look forward to. We might as well put the tree up. But yeah, that was our little garden set the hall. I'm now going to make a steak pie that Jordan got from the garden centre and get cosy and pot around the house and then we'll take Corby out a little bit later. But that's the plan for now. Hello guys. So I haven't spoken to you since a little bit earlier on. It is now quarter past seven and we are still going. We are going to get an Indian tonight. Um, we're going to get a little takeaway but we're just busy. As you can hear, we're still doing house stuff. Um, so a little bit of progress. I don't know if I, have I showed you this bathroom? I don't know. But Jordan has put up these pictures for me. I had these in the old apartment. Um, and I just think they're really nice. So this is the bathroom. This is how it's looking at the minute. This is the main bathroom. And then we have shower, bath, little bath tray. This is getting sold, so this won't be here, but I need to sell it. Jordan is shouting me, so let me go and see what he wants. Yes, Jordan? Is there any need for that tone of voice? Well, I've had three times. Right. Jordan's now got a power tool, okay, and thinks he's some sort of handyman, so he's cutting down shelves to put in his dressing room. Well, it is currently... 8.30 and our Indian is here. Shock, Jordan's eating when I'm filming again. Pop dance, we've got naan, we've got tikka masala and korma because we really are basic bitches. And Jordan likes to pretend that he's out there eating spicy stuff, but really he's got a korma. He's been exposed. So yeah, this is our plan. We're gonna eat this, watch a film and get cozy. Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Excuse the state of me, but I need to show you the breakfast that Jordan has just made for me because I am honestly a little bit shook. Get ready for this. We have got croissants, jam. Look at that. How I'm sorry, but I would pay a good £13 in a brunch place for that. I'll tell you that now. Oh my God, thank you so much, Jordan. We are going to dig in and enjoy a nice Sunday brunch. Shock, Jordan has started eating before I finished filming. Do you want to go on a walkies? Yeah, I do. Yeah, go tell your dad. Go meet your dad then. Go meet your dad. No, Dion. Under. Yeah, it's a flick of the wrist. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can't spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas. guys Kobe will not come in the house ever since the, we lived in the apartment he thinks it's a game to just not come in the house like and he wants to play zoomies every time so he just sprints <laughs> Kobe in <laughs> and his paws are so wet <laughs> Kobe in the house he is just so annoying. Right guys, we are back from Corby's walk. We have tidied the house. It's nice and cosy. I am, hello sweetheart. Now we've got a very tired little pup today, don't we? He's tired. Um, I'm gonna sit and write my to-do list for the week. This is from HA Designs. I get asked all the time and I bought my own inserts for it. So what I have in is daily to-dos. I don't know if that's gonna focus. Let me move my head out of the way. Yeah, so you can kind of see it's daily to-dos, so like tasks, goals, 
email, emails and calls, unfinished tasks. So I'm going to write my to-do list for the week. Um, I like to do this on a Sunday because then I feel like I know what I need to do and get up and have a productive Monday. Um, and then we're going to have a Sunday dinner, watch new Alma Celeb and go to bed. So that is the plan. I hope you enjoyed this little weekend vlog, something a bit different because I usually don't vlog on a weekend. But yeah, make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Bye.